Hi, and welcome to InjuryGuru.com. I'm Carla Schimmelfinnig, Registered Physical Therapist. Uh, if you have just completed the exercise program number one for the wrist, uh, and you're having less pain, you find you can do more, uh, then you are ready for this next program. Hopefully you find that you can uh, get ready easier, uh, grab and uh, reach for things, pick up things, push and pull uh, with, with less pain to that wrist and less swelling as well overall. This program will uh, start the strengthening process. So it'll start to uh, get strength back in that wrist, strength that you used to have before this was hurt or injured. Um, I'm going to ask you to uh, do these exercises uh, just one time per day now. I want you to try to do them five to six times a week, and I want you to commit to four to six weeks. Um, you, in order to get strengthening done, uh, you do need it a longer period of time. So try to commit to this for four to six weeks. If anywhere along that uh, time period you find that your strength is good, you're happy with it, you can do what you need to do, uh, and it feels um, similar to the other side, then you can stop doing the exercise program. But uh, by all means, stick with it as long as you need to. For this exercise program, you do need some type of resistance. So I'm going to show you um, uh, several things that you can use. Uh, you can use um, dumbbells, and uh, you can go to your local uh, Walmart, Target, or uh, sports store. Uh, you can get any of the, uh, most of the equipment that I'm going to show you, you can get at those stores. Um, but you can um, just buy a light dumbbell. Um, now, when I say light, what does that mean? Um, it's hard to determine through video, through a website, um, what weight you'll be able to use. I can't test you like I do my patients when I see them in the clinic. So. Um, typically, though, uh, most adults can handle um, anything at this at this phase, um, anything from three to five pound dumbbells. So when you go to the store, you could always um, just do a test, grab the three pound dumbbell, and um, do one of those or two of those exercises that you've been performing in exercise program number one. Um, and see if that's um, a challenging weight for you. I don't want it too easy, but certainly not so hard that you can't do the exercise or so hard that it causes pain. Uh, so dumbbells are a great thing to use. Uh, you can also use TheraBands or uh, this is what we call TheraTube. Um, you can also get these at Target. In fact, um, at Target they sell uh, these TheraBands, um, I think three in a package, and you can get that for around $12. Uh, and that's, um, I, I really do uh, like this method because you'll have different resistances. So each color represents a different resistance. So you'll have different resistances for um, the, all the different exercises you're going to do. Um, you can also use the TheraTubing um, at Target. These are just sold one in a box. Um, so you may have to um, buy a couple of these. Uh, that's up to you. If um, you don't want to purchase anything, you aren't able to purchase anything, you can always use a can of beans or a can of soup from your pantry. Um, so I just want you to be using some kind of resistance. You need some type of resistance uh, uh, for this exercise program since it is working on strengthening. Um, for a couple of, of, of the exercises I'm going to show you, you can actually use a hammer or, um, a, or other tools, things that you have around your house. So um, just uh, bear with me. Uh, get some equipment if you um, want to. Otherwise, you can stick with uh, just something from your pantry. So let me show you the first exercise, exercise number one in this wrist exercise program number two. The first exercise in this program is called wrist flexion, and I'm going to show you with the weight first. Um, so I want you to sit in that position uh, that, you're, that you have seen me uh, use if you've been uh, viewing the uh, uh, rest of these exercises, our wrist uh, exercise program number one. All right, and it just looks like this. So you have already been doing this exercise in wrist exercise program number one. It's just now we're adding some weight to it. Again, to work on that strengthening. And let me show you that with the TheraBand. Right, so I have that, that other, uh, one end of the TheraBand under my foot. And again, in this position, and I'm just going to take that TheraBand in my hand and do wrist flexion. Or bringing, with my palm up, bringing that wrist and hand toward my face. Right, so that's with the TheraBand. 
same thing with the can, just wrist flexion, palm up, bringing that hand and wrist toward my face or toward your face. Uh, when you do these exercises, I want you to do uh, three sets of 12 to 15 repetitions. Uh, I give you that range of 12 to 15 because it's anywhere where it starts to where you start to feel fatigue. So you feel the muscles work, and you may even feel um, a burn or an ache in the muscle, and that's good if it's not your typical pain. Um, you don't want to do these exercises. You don't want to continue to do an exercise that causes your typical wrist pain. Modify it if you can. Use less um, use less resistance, so a smaller dumbbell or a different um, TheraBand or TheraTube. I want, I want you to uh, commit to doing these five to six times a week and uh, just once a day. Oh.